All right, looking at number 12, it says the triangles are similar. And so if I know they're similar, then my angles are the same and my side lengths are proportional. I'm going to highlight the two heights and then I'm going to color in orange the two bases. What that does is that's going to help me then make my proportion. I'm ignoring these proportions that are down here. Okay, that's a strategy that I like to use so that I don't get too confused. So I've got small triangle and I'll do big triangle. Those are the names of my ratios. So orange small is 2.4. Yellow small is X. Orange big is 3. Yellow big is 5. So remember what we talked about in question 11, that no matter how I set it up, we still have to look for the same diagonal. Well, it's the same thing here. 3 and X are diagonal from each other. So we have to look and see if we have 3 and X diagonal. So 5 and X are diagonal here, so I'm going to say no. 5 and X are diagonal here, so that's a no. So 3 and X are diagonal there. X and 2.4, no. So if you use the strategy of first setting it up the way that you would set it up and then always look to see, if mine has 3 and X on the diagonal, your other answer choices that work also have to have the same thing. So answer C is for number 12.